Hello, church family. I just wanted to connect with you for a few minutes today to talk about uh, the resumption of in-person gatherings here in British Columbia. Again, we're really excited to be, have this opportunity to connect together to sort of see each other across the room and uh, connect in this way. I want to let you know we are planning to open up uh, for the first time on Easter Sunday uh, as the day to uh, connect here in person. Uh, it looks like in the current variants that we have to the health order that the regulations are that we'll only have four days uh, to be able to have uh, gatherings over the course of time. So we want to make all of those things count. So we want to use Easter Sunday and the three Sundays following that as our four days over the course of the months ahead in hopes that perhaps we might get a few more days or even be able to continue to meet uh, and as time goes forward uh, in those days to come. And so Sunday, tomorrow, uh, Palm Sunday, will again be at the live stream service at 10. Good Friday will also be the live stream service at 10 o'clock. And then Easter Sunday, we will uh, have a number of services that will play out over the course of time. We'll give you some more information about that, hopefully on Monday or Tuesday, uh, as we kind of finish working out all the kinks around this idea. One other thing we want to make sure that you're aware of is we want to make sure the expectations for these events are as accurate as they possibly can be. Again, these current set of restrictions that we've been given to us by the Public Health Authority are a bit more stringent than they were in the summer. And so we want to let you know that uh, even though we will be able to be here present in the room, there'll be fewer of, uh, fewer of us because it's uh, 50 people or 10% of the capacity of the room. So in our case, it'll be 40 people because it's a room for 400 people. And this 40 people needs to also include uh, the people who are here to serve and make the service help, uh, come together as well. Also, uh, the directive from the health authority is that uh, only the worship team on the platform can sing and nobody else in the room is allowed to sing. And we have to make sure that uh, we, there's no socializing before, during or after the event. And we're only allowed to host in-person services if we can say that these, this is how this will play out. So just want to make you aware of a couple of things playing into this. Again, that's sort of a bit of the picture of how this will play out and move through along with all the regular restrictions around masks and social distancing and that whole shebang will be a part of how this will play out together. Again, we're really excited about this time together and the opportunity to, uh, to see a bit more of each other uh, in the days ahead. This is an initial step towards reopening religious gatherings, and so we're excited to be able to do this together. Looking forward to it, I would ask that you would pray for us for wisdom and guidance and clarity and creativity as we continue to work through these things. And I look forward to uh, seeing you Easter Sunday in about eight days.